वेलकम टू द फिफ्थ डिस्कशन ऑन कॉम्बिनेशन कॉम्बिनेशन प्रॉबिलिटी इन दिस आई विल डिस्कस कॉम्बिनेशन even though you won't get a direct combination question in any bank paper but as i told from the very beginning of the discussions that this has every relation relationship with probability so if you are not bothering this and you are directly bothering probability you are wasting your valuable time now <coughs> in some part of the discussions as i told before that i may go beyond the bank pure questions little bit beyond the scope do not worry they are easy now here is a question how many different triangles can be formed using three points basically meaning i have three points how many different triangles i can make obviously only one triangle in how many ways the triangles can be named so as i told in the previous video that it can be named by a b c b c a and so on if there are three it's three factorial that is six the normal question that comes to me is the most obvious question where to use permutation because here i'm using permutation and where to use combination getting how many triangles can be formed using three points is done by the way of combination like this there are three points and i require three points to make a triangle this is 3c3 formula of a combination is ncr is n factorial by r factorial into n minus r factorial looks tough not a data of formula it is n3 factorial in this divided by 3 factorial into 3 minus 3 factorial so this is 3 factorial by 3 factorial into 0 factorial this gone 0 factorial is 1 so this is 1 so when student ask me where to know how where to use combination and where to use permutation is obviously a quite clear question a quite genuine question but the answer is not so clear let me try to make it a bit clear look at this formed or selected made possible these are the synonyms these are the codes that look at this use combination this formula use can be named arranged use permutations done you can automatically gain the confidence in tackling the tough problems on this so this is permutation question you can use a formula also npr here your ncr how many straight lines can be formed from 25 points so how many points are there there are 25 points how many i require for a straight line to make only two any two can give me a straight line any two can give me a straight line of my own choice i'll just pick up any two points it will give me a straight line so this is 25 c 2 this will give me the answer now obvious enough this number has to be bigger than this number otherwise you will find a negative minus 3 factorial carries no meaning now how many diagonals are there in a quadrilateral 
So, if I will give you a quadrilateral and I will tell you how many diagonals are possible, anybody of us can say that there are two diagonals. The mathematics behind this is something really to enjoy. Let me say, if I will ask you how many triangles can be formed using four points. Here we go. If we'll, you are bothering the triangles, this is one triangle, second triangle, th third triangle and so on, we may miss some triangles. So the basic way how many triangles can be formed is 4, C, 3. Get the answer. It will be 4. So if there are 25 points, how many triangles can be formed is 25, C, 3. Now, I asked you how many diagonals are possible in a, in a, in a quadrilateral. So let me just see that these four points are somewhere and how many straight lines I can make overall is 4, C, 2. For straight lines I require only 2. For triangle I require 3. So this will give me some figure. It's 4 factorial by 2 factorial into 2 factorial. This is 6. On that, how many are the sides? 1, 2, 3 and 4. These are the 4 sides. And this is true that if there are four points there will be four sides so in a quadrilateral there are four points there are four vertices there are four sides so this is the six that I can make any form on this four points I can get any six six lines and of those six lines four lines are my sides so this is 2. I believe I am making it clear because if this is how many diagonals are there in a decagon. So when it is a case of decagon, how many points are there? There are 10 points in a decagon. If there are 10 vertices or 10 points, how many lines are possible? Is 10 C2. Any, any form of line of my choice. On that, how many are sides? As, as there are 10 vertices or 10 points, it must have 10 sides. So these are the sides. Anything other than that is giving me diagonals. So it's 10 C2 minus 10. I'm making it further clear that if there are 10 points, I can get at best total 10 C2 lines. On that lines, decagon comes from the word deca which is 10. If it's having 10 vertices or 10 points, it must have 10 sides. So whatever is left that is called a diagonal. Thanks for watching.